Hello people, thank you for joining me today. This is going to be part two to the reindeer project what I did last week. This week we're going to be building the sleigh, but it's going to have to be in a two part series I'm afraid. Uh, I'll try and get the second part of it up as quick as le quickly as I can. Um, the second part will be the actual painting, sanding and filling of the, the actual sleigh. Uh, it took actually longer than I anticipated to make this, so it's going to be a two-parter. Uh, either that or the video would have been about three quarters of an hour long, and I know you don't want to sit there watching my ugly mug for that length of time, so uh, it's going to be two parts. So, just going to get on and work our way through it up to the point where I'll stop it. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here So as you can see with that bit though, you're going to have to stack cut it while you cut that out This is 18mm MDF And my little, uh, my bandsaw, I've not got a 8 inch blade, I only use a quarter inch blade So you're going to have to stack cut And uh, either make these bigger Which is the they're supposed to be the design of it, it's supposed to be a lot bigger than this or you're going to have to stack cut it and cut it uh, on a scroll saw just in these pieces here because the band saw won't cut that tight of a, a curve It's clear to see from up here world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful You and me We meant to be In the great outdoors Forever free Sometimes 
times you need to go and take a step back to see the truth around you from a distance you can tell Same with the runners as well. You're gonna to have to stack cut these and cut that out on these because it's too tight of a curve to do it on a bandsaw. Pretty please for Christmas. Can I have a bobbin sander?
Right guys, as you can see, I've glued and screwed from the inside the outer rails. Now, these runners are supposed to go on the inside, like so. Now, all I've done now is put three screws in and I'll put a bead of wood glue on the on the inside down there just to hold it in place like so I'm just going to screw the front bit on now and then we'll go from there There you go, I've got the back and the front glued on now, so you can start seeing the general shape of what it's going to turn out like, and then we'll get the other side. And that goes on there like so. What I've done, I've measured the width of an 18mm piece of MDF so that bit in here is actually going to sit inside like so so that mark, the bottom mark on this piece of wood what I've put will line up with the bottom of this and then I'm just going to put a bottom in from the other side then Right now, <clears throat> I've put the runners on, all that's left at doing now is just get a bit of filler and go over these screw heads, uh, give it a sanding down and then we've got some paint on it. Uh, this one is about 15 inches by 10 inches tall. Now the original one with the original design is a lot bigger than this, uh, but like I said, this is only going. On, it's going on top of a a TV unit at the minute. Once it's built, along with the reindeer in front. Right. So from that last clip, though, what you've just seen, uh, all the sleighs put together now. I've just got to put a bottom into the sleigh, and then it's a case of uh, sanding it, filling it and uh, painting it up um, so if you like the project up to now and you like what you've seen please give me a thumbs up leave me in a comment in the section down below I'll leave all the links to my social media in the description box down below <clears throat> and uh, I'll see you in part two thank you for joining me see you again soon